Hi guys, welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Let's go figure out what the church is all about. You have returned, Seeker. Are you prepared to open your heart to the teachings of the Machine God? Well, I am the Machine God, but you know, tell me about your church. This singularity church of the Machine God. For augmented only? The word of the Mother. Only the gifted will ascend. She has cast out the flesh flood in preparation. So you're here on a recruitment drive to fill up the numbers. And more. The Builder lives in this place. The dreamer of our ascension. Now, cast out at the will of the Mother. Let me guess. He's one of the flesh flawed. No. He simply had a crisis of faith. But I am not so blinded by my faith as others are. He was a friend once. A mentor. A leader in our church. Some of us remember. Do you have more questions? Ascension. Tell me more about this ascension. Our minds will depart their corporeal shells and merge with the divine consciousness of the machine god. This is the ascension. Sounds like you're talking about uploading a copy of your brains to a computer. I didn't think that was possible yet. Thanks to the builder, it is. But it is much more than a simple copy. It is transference. Yosef called it an evolution of the human condition. Do you have more questions, Seeker? No. Nothing right now. Maybe some other time. Very well, Seeker. I will be here if you change your mind. Alright. Seek and you will find my friend. The machine god. Isn't that um That's one of the endings from Deus Ex One. It's not really a god, it's it, it was Icarus, I think. Let's open this door. Actually, let's let's have a look at our map to see where we actually want to go. Well, our objective is that way. So we should probably do that, actually, so. Just run really fast. What else going on here? Bodyguard? If you're not shopping, you don't need to stick around. You looking for the best prices in Prague? I'm not talking hot dogs here. If the hot dogs aren't your main business, why don't you have a store? See, this way, I get to keep my overhead down. And pass on the savings to the customers. Entrepreneurial. Better believe it. What did you got? Well, I got info. The kind that's worth something. Could always use reliable intel. Who couldn't? But for that, I only accept payment in your opposite. I don't have any. Sorry, it's a deal breaker. But find me again if you get any, okay? Well, I'm watching. No funny move. Buy what you need and clear out. Alright, well, we're gonna need to get some neuropazine. Stop the oppression. That's right, yeah. Look, the terrorist thing, that's bad. I'm not saying it isn't. But it's just a thing. It'll pass in time. That is the most ignorant. You can't be serious. One affects you, the other doesn't. It's that simple. When was the last time you were affected by organized crime? I wasn't affected by the train station either. I wasn't there. Look, I'm just saying, they're gonna be living with criminals like the Diwali long after the terrorists make their point and fuck off. So the mayor's plan gets my support. You, stop right there! Yeah, you! Down on your knees! Okay, okay, but they... Eyes behind your head. Like this? Yes, I'm going to frisk you now. Don't move. I'm not carrying anything. That's for me to find out. But there Hold still. Mistake. Then you have nothing to worry about. Okay, hands behind your back. Oh, I know. You're innocent. Just like everyone else. I don't know what to do. I've never been in any kind of legal trouble before. Be yeah, that's what you get for being a filthy og. Piece of shit, and that's lagging. Hey, right, hey. Street is off limits, Oyobok. Private function. All businesses are temporarily closed. This district. There is only wrong. Wait, wait, wait. I don't want to get shut up. So wait, we can't go over there yet? It would appear not. Alright, I guess we gotta go do the other. Or either sneak past or something else. Let's see what our thing is. Find oh, color inside the bookstore. Alright. I guess we'll do that then. 
Alright, where's the other objective? Oh, dude, there's beer here. I might go there. I need to zoom out. Fuck. It, apparently, the scroll wheel is really slow, and so is this. Alright, we gotta go. Okay, we gotta go to the other fucking side of town. Alright, I'm gonna go to the beer store, though. I fucking augmented people. Christ, what were they thinking? Alright, getting augmented. Guys, I am I am anti ogs. Let me just tell you that right now. I'm gonna kill those og motherfuckers. Also, I can hate myself. Perfectly fine. Oh, uh, oh, uh, here we go. Ah, uh, shit. Slovel baby. So, nah, I can't pronounce it. Beer. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering, I can't read check. I I can understand certain can phrases and say you? certain things. All right, bitch. I want. I want a pint. What can I get you? Beer? Something else? Beer. What else would I want? I'll have a beer. Here you go. Anything else? Uh, ask what else. What else have you got? Oh, just an item of interest. For someone who lives off of their sales, you're unusually reserved. Well, sometimes it's hard to know who to trust. Especially these days. For example, I don't suppose you have any Neuroposine you would be willing to spare, do you? Sorry, I don't. That's okay, I understand. Times are tough. Is there anything I can do for you? Why is Neuroposine a fucking currency? I'm good for now. As you wish. And she gave me a goddamn can. That's not worth 10 Hello credits. Again. I want a refund. What can I do for you? Yeah, where's the refund option? I'm good for now. Okay. Alright. As you wish. I want the beer. Like 10 credits for a fucking can? Well, okay, I'm just gonna- I'm gonna fucking be on your, your fucking ceiling fan. Alright. Fuck, I'll just drink my can and go. Jeez. Like, I keep- whenever I jump up on this stuff, I always jump onto something I don't mean to. Alright. This is pretty much how I envisioned I would be playing this game. Right now. Alright. Uh, actually, it says for- the objective is this way. Travel to uh, whatever. I said your papers are expired. <gasps> so they just Ogs. Ogs. So they can my Where's the non-ogs? Oh, naturals. Oh shit. All right. Why, why can't I make it over there though? Oh, I I know why I can't. <laughs> Am I supposed to stealth there? Yeah, uh, let's let's try that place again, because I'm curious about the other ways. Let's open up the... Apparently that's going to have a car alarm. Oh, grenade launcher. I, I just, I just, I totally just, like, fucking took a grenade launcher. Holy shit, I just got a grenade launcher. <laughs> Dude, I can customize it? What can I customize it with? Oh, I can put, like, different grenades in there. Oh, I guess these are my actual grenades. Alright. What's this one? How can I customize this? Alright, so we can do 4x scope, uh, arrow piercing, and I can have a laser on it. Oh, and I can upgrade it with uh, the fucking... the little parts I have. Alright. Don't forget the button. Doc Larry! Doc Larry! Show me latest papers. Otherwise, you cannot go through. I know the drill. The drill has changed. Too many forgeries. All Ogs must now carry a supplementary permit authentication card. Do you have this card? My documentation's never been a problem before. It's not about to become one now. You sure about this? I am policeman. You see uniform. You see, gun. You know, now that you mention it, your setup looks a little odd. Budget cuts? No need to insult us. Times are difficult for a regional document checking police. But fact remains. If you continue this way without newest permit, I am legally obliged to shoot you. Is that right? My friend, I know what you're thinking. It's terrible the way they make laws against your kind. But listen, maybe I can do something to help. We could come to an understanding. 
What kind of understanding? Lucky for you, I know a guy. An expert in... Permitification. A document agent. He offers permits, authentication cards. Peace of mind. With his help, you go wherever you want, whenever you want. No more hassles. What do you say? Uh... Supposing I wanted to pass through here right now, before getting this special document of yours. Any way for me to do that? Sure. I suggest our pay-and-go plan. It consists of you paying me, and then me letting you go. You mean bribery? Wink, wink, my friend. I prefer the term standard fine. Tell you what, I'll even give you the good citizen discount. Just this once. Out of the box. Seems to me like you're taking advantage of arms, preying on their paranoia. I am in the business of selling hope. A chance to walk free, to stay out of Gollum. Otherwise you risk trouble with the law. Not fun for a foreign og like you. Maybe they send you home. Maybe somewhere worse. You think you can take advantage of Oggs because they're all too scared to say no to you? You know how much this reeks of extortion, right? The problem is with the lawmakers, not me. They keep finding ways to target you because you're augmented. Don't try to blame this on anyone else. You're the one who stopped me in the street. You're the one I'm talking to. And I'm telling you you're wrong. I'm not abusing power. I'm enforcing rules I don't necessarily agree with, while also trying to help people get around them. You need to see this as an opportunity. You need to see this friend of mine. I can attack him? Oh, shit. Uh, I'm, okay, I can't save it. Whatever, fine. Fuck, attack it. You and your hoods need to stand down and let me pass. Otherwise, this ends badly for you. You don't get to threaten me, asshole. Let me explain how this works. Ogs buy whatever I offer for however much I say. Otherwise, I make example of them by shooting them in the face, like this. Was that shit? Forms. You hear that? Okay. Draw his cloak. Oh god. <laughs> wow, I'm, I'm already in a scuffle with the police. Okay, everybody hates me. Even the guys over there hate me. I have my new battle rifle. It's really fucking... Well, I don't want to fucking make them kill me. Great, I can only go back to here. I wish I could quick I wish I could have quick saved it, because now like now like all I have to kill all the police. I don't want to do that. All right, I'm back at where the last dialogue option was. I'm just gonna play along. This document agent you mentioned, you see the one in charge? He gets you to stop Oggs and offer them this opportunity to do business with him. Go see for yourself. My friend has documents to pass checkpoints, to keep police off your back, to get into parts of Prague you never knew existed. Tell him Drahumir sent you. You'll see. I give you address, yes? All right, give me the address. I think I'd like to see who's behind all this. Chekashka. There is a courtyard behind the apartment building. Very easy to find. My friend will be there. He will get you latest permit card. Just pay him and don't ask questions. All right. So, I like I want to be an asshole, but I don't want to be a fucking Dead asshole, so. Alright, there's a ladder over there. Let's try and do this the Mike Lat stealth way. How much longer is it going to be? Which is copyrighted, do not steal. Alright, here we go. This is an interesting advertisement. Uh. 
Gotta look around. Oh, there's uh, some. I can kind of go into here. Shit, what the hell? What? Okay, it's very random when it decides that I can jump really high and not. I should have. I could have actually typhooned them. Oh, this isn't a uh, uh, unauthorized area. All right, we can hack this guy. I, I, I don't know how I led to this situation. What's clearance? Okay, so we have a clearance thing. We have a data store over there. That would be kind of nice to get. So if we go like this way, this way, this way, up until there, that would be kind of good. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Oh, it's actually really easy now. How long is this taking? Thank you. Okay, we've got the data store. Oh shit, this is gonna be close. Alright, we did it. It's actually really smooth now for that thing. Alright, so, welcome to your full-time position at San Tao. Okay, literally do not care, still friends. Alright, these guys have shitty email. Alright, I'm logging out of this guy's email. Uh, oh, we got some part more crafting parts. Wouldn't mind that. I'm learning that the, that battle rifle is like extremely hard, uh, extremely poor handling. I mean, let's see. How much can I customize it to improve its handling? Maybe the laser sight would hit work. Yeah, it's accuracy. Oh, standard aim stability augmentation affects this stat. Well, let's see what that is actually. Uh, okay, everything's arrowed out, so <laughs> we can't fucking deal with that right now. Dude, I can't even open this door. What the fuck? I thought this would be like a back way in. Maybe we can get up there. Uh, fuck. Oh, why? Well, I, I landed on something. Okay. Oh, way up there. Okay, let's see. Shit. It's very hard to handle, but I'm sure I'll get used to it at some point. Alright, let's see. Ah, there we go. We made it to the top here. What's this all about? Literally some useless stuff I don't really care about. Can we make it up there? No. Alright, it looks like we can't- we gotta go through the checkpoint, so. That's rather fucking unfortunate, guys. Because I, I would have loved to just kill them all. Alright, what's this guy? Uh, this is nothing. Alright, so let's look at our quest line. So... Uh... I'll have to get past the gravel thugs who are tearing up the time machine and make sure he's okay. Actually, wait. Am I just supposed to fucking... Am I just supposed to knock them all the fuck out, actually? Because, okay, so there's a checkpoint here that leads over here, which could also go into here. But there's also that sewer entrance. Let's have a look. Oh, fuck it. Let's just try and go fucking... Like, no, nobody nobody tells Adam Jensen where he can and can't go. Is it everywhere? You're trespassing, metal man. Uh... I mean, stop. The, the problem is there's that other guy there. I, I think I have an idea of how to. I think I have an idea of how to handle this. Alright, let's use my bio cell. Let's, let's try this the mic that way. Uh, oh, I can't stealth myself. One sec. Always trust the mic that way. And I didn't even have to kill anybody. So I have no stealthing Uggs at all.
Okay, there's maybe a couple more people here than there need to be. I always like the Mike Flat way of dealing with problems. Actually, we have a shotgun now. Oh fuck, I didn't want to vault over this shit. Fuck. I, did, I pressed the wrong button. Alright, let's use the health injector. Let's try, uh, let's bring out the shotgun. Where is that guy? Oh, it kind of needed ammo. Guys, diplomacy failed. Uh, let's get the battle rifle out, actually. I can't just do that. Got enough energy. He's like right over here, isn't he? Where is this guy? Fuck, I can't see it because I have no energy constantly. Well, rather than dealing with the guy at the fucking checkpoint... We decided. Ah, oh, it's all fucking ammunition and shit. Much better way of dealing with this uh, issue. Although it would have been nice to be able to stealth this. All right, who's in here? Right over here. Right over here. Nice bullet to the fucking face. There we are. Oh, look at these guys. They have absolutely no idea where I am. Uh, well, there's some ventilation shafts, I'm sure, over here somewhere. Fuck. Climbing up on bookshelves is harder than it looks, guys. Well, dealt with that problem pretty well. Problem solved. Only a relatively high body count. Alright, what's over here? Oh, dude, his computer. Jensen! Thank God! I'm down in the dungeon, man. You remember the title of my super secret book, right? I remember it's red. Well, I want to read his computer. Let's look at his emails. Oh, dude, only a hacking fucking security system of two. Except I can't, I can't open that. So whatever. All right, let's let's bring out the shotgun. Definitely need a silencer on this thing. Oh, dude, he's got a bunch of og arms. The Adam Jensen way of solving problems is the best way. Jensen, my favorite techno wonder kind. Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? They're not gonna be a problem anymore. What do they want? You behind on your protection money? I, I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. You know how it is with these gangster types. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. 
Diwali internal politics. I... I'm gonna get it sorted. Gonna see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down. The day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. You know I've always wanted to get a closer look at those sadie fogs of yours. A real close look. So, uh... So let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then... Well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Uh, feel my way around. Hang on a sec, you're gonna put me under for how long? What if the Diwali send reinforcements? Oh, you're just stalling. Those illiterates aren't going to get in here. Don't be scared of the chair, okay? The chair is gentle. I promise. This thing with the Diwali is nothing. Otar's pissing where he shouldn't. I count on you to fix me, Kohler. To some extent, your problems are my problems. That's sweet, Jensen. Otar Botkoveli is the Diwali number two guy. The men outside, they were his men. But the big boss man is Radic Nikoladze. He is the number one guy. And I know Radic, so... So don't worry about it. Now, are we gonna do this procedure, or what? What exactly are you going to do to me? I'm not sure yet. First, I got to get in there to see what's wrong. But don't worry. I'm not going to do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. I promise. Besides, you've been here a few times. You know I'm professional. You've never had to put me under before. I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. Kaboom! Now, you want me to fix you, or not? All right. Let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. It's... it's gonna be fine. You... you won't even know I'm in there. You feel weightless, far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it. I swear I didn't mean to... Your retinal display should be back soon. You can still move, right? Where, where did you...? I was... I was trying to connect the unconnected. But you got some strange fucking augs back there. I mean, I, I probably shouldn't have. Here, let me get you some water. Or something stronger, maybe? Water. You got it, Jensen. Just, uh... Just ease out. Okay, don't freak out. Rebooting was the only way to save you. Save me from what, Colin? Core meltdown. You almost melted my chair. So I reset you, and I found these... these, uh... I think it's better if I show you what I found. Bring up your system display. You need to see this for yourself. These are your implants. You're familiar with all these, right? Yeah. David Seraph installed them. Took two years for my body to get used to everything. Right. Well... I had to undo some of that getting used to. What's going on, Kohler? Why do I feel different? Something was trying to vampire the juice out of you. I couldn't figure out what until after the reboot. Turns out your Factory Zero is not the standard Factory Zero. What am I looking at? Experimental fucking test dogs, man. Hidden inside your body. You're telling me I got more implants than I thought I did? More than your body can handle. Pretty cool, right? I'm not sure yet. I want to show you what happens when you activate one of these suckers. Uh, uh. Uh. 
that, click the icon to act, select one of the augmentation. Okay. Find Titan. Let's see what that does. See that? Major spike in your power consumption. Where the hell did these things come from? I can't answer that. All I know is the explosion must have woken them up. But man, you want to use these crazy fucking things? That's your right. We just got to make sure it doesn't fry you. Now, I think I maybe got an idea on how to do that. Try shutting down one of your other implants. You know, just for fun. All right. Uh, shut down. I don't know, I can't shut Go down ahead, that. Go ahead, Jensen. Shut down one of the implants you're not using. Well, what the fuck am I not using? I, I think I'm using a lot of this. Oh, there we go. Deactivation mode. Okay, what am I not? Jensen. Shut down one of the implants you're not using. See that? Cooled you right down. You have the power to balance your system if you want. Just, you know, don't activate everything all at once. What would happen if I did? Well, you'd suffer some major glitches due to overheating. We're talking risk of permanent damage. So, you know, maybe don't do that. All right. Reset me now, Kohler. I'll reactivate what I need myself. Okay. So I'm not always gonna be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. I thought you were supposed to be my AUG expert. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man! I'm pretty sure they're not from Mars. I just... I feel bad. You deserve answers I can't give you. I can help manage your system better than anyone in Prague. They help you make the most of the new augs we just found. But you can't tell me where the hell they came from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my augs. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris' work. These new augs, they... They look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? Seriously, if you talk to Sarif, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. You ever seen anything like this before? An odd system that's deliberately hidden like that? I don't know, Jensen. I mean, I heard the people getting the black market treatment before. Pass out in Prague, wake up in Shanghai. But usually they wake up with less augs, not more. What exactly makes these augs so different from my other ones? They look like experiments, is what. Loose wiring everywhere, man. It's, it's like half of you is uh, untested, unfinished, unbelievable. It's, it's beautiful, is what it is. Why would Seraph have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. I am not convinced this is a Sarif job. The tech itself is super high-end, but the PDOT insulation, sloppy. The bone mounting mounted on the quick. Just doesn't have Sarif's touch. Looks more like a retrofit to me. Something much more recent. Well, what are you thinking? I'm thinking how much I hate being unconscious. You said these additions look recent. How recent? Within the last two years, give or take. Something happened to you in that time? I was pulled out of the ocean and put in some facility in Alaska to recover. It was a few months there that... The more I try to remember, the blurrier it gets. Shit, Jensen. That's terrifying. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's wrap this up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Praxis solves everything. Keeps customers happy. 
Just uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's gonna be a balancing act for you. Well, unless... Unless what, Connor? There could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. A neuroplasticity calibrator. There's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise? I want to know about it. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? But... My last shipment got intercepted... by Otar Botkoveli. The same Otar whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. If that sounds like something that interests you, then you should know that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard of Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Connor. Thanks for the praxis. Alright. The augmentations hold. Is, can he reset and me again? You know I love you, Jensen, but we both have work to do. What do you need? Ah, yeah, whatever. Guess that's, that's all I need for now, Doc. Yeah, yeah, okay. And hey, good luck with that shit. Don't fry yourself, alright? Alright guys, that's all the time we got for today. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.